Now, receiving your diploma is a symbol of a new beginning, but as News Channel 9's Christina Galvin explains, this class's junior and senior years during the pandemic gave them a dose of reality a whole lot sooner. After four years at Syracuse University, it's time for Casey Nardino to say goodbye. It's kind of surreal. Like, I never, I knew I was going to graduate, but, you know, it was kind of like, oh, in four years, in three years, and now it's two years, now it's here. One day, when she tells her children and grandchildren what college was like her senior year during a pandemic, will be a story for the ages. In the first semester, it was like a little bit jarring just because you think of college as this huge, crazy social place, um, and it was not. You know, everything kind of had to be reeled in a little bit. Um, but then definitely second semester with the nice weather and uh, people getting vaccinated, it's definitely been a lot better. Um, and I think Syracuse has done a really good job just trying to give us that college experience while also being safe. The university will try to keep families safe this commencement weekend, too. To spread everyone out, there'll be three ceremonies, one on Saturday and two on Sunday. Three people will be seated together with two guests allowed per graduate. So it's just my parents and everyone has to stay like six feet apart um, from each other. We already walked and everything, so it's just we're having, you know, a commencement speaker and yeah, so it's definitely a, a, a bit weird, but I'm just happy we're having one. She's lucky to have one, well aware of how dire the coronavirus spread was on campus just last month. The same place where she walks across the stage is where she did her part to keep her classmates safe. This past semester, I was at the Dome Testing Center. I was just kind of like making test tubes, giving them to students, um, which was very interesting. I never thought that that would be my job ever. I think it's definitely taught me a lot. A lot of things that I didn't realize I needed to learn. Um, which is cool. When class should be the hardest part, these seniors learned so much more. At Syracuse University, Christina Galvin, News Channel 9. That they did. Nardino says she hopes to land a television job in Los Angeles and has been doing the job research there. Syracuse University is also live streaming their ceremonies online, and we have the link to watch posted for you right on localsyr.com.